वेलकम यू ऑल टू माई चैनल टांग टू टमी इंट्रोड्यूसिंग सुपर क्रीमी सॉफ्ट एगलेस चॉकलेट मूज रेसिपी विद जस्ट थ्री इन्ग्रीडियंट्स सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड आई विल बी यूजिंग डार्क कंपाउंड दिस इज फ्रॉम मोड दे दिस इज अ फोर हंड्रेड ग्राम पैकेट यू कैन ऑर्डर इट ऑनलाइन और गो टू एनी बेकरी एसेंशियल्स शॉप टू बाय दिस द फर्स्ट स्टेप इज टू फाइनली चॉप टू हंड्रेड ग्राम डार्क कंपाउंड The compound should be at room temperature. The finely chopped chocolate will melt faster than the large chunks. You can also use Kavacha dark chocolate for this recipe if you wish. Transfer the chopped chocolate in a separate bowl that can be easily placed on a saucepan to make a double boiler. To make the ganache, add 100 g fresh cream to the dark compound. Make sure the fresh cream is at room temperature. Heat 1 cup water in a little saucepan and let the water come to a boil. Now keep the heat low. Place the bowl on top of the pan. You have to keep in mind the hot water should not touch the bowl or it should not be too close to the bowl. With the help of a spatula, start mixing the cream with the chocolate. The chocolate will melt from the heat of the steam. This process is known as double boiler method. At this point, you can also turn off the heat and continue mixing. But I prefer to keep the flame low and stir constantly until I get the desired state. Using a silicone spatula will help to scrape or mix the melted chocolate easily. You can also microwave to make the ganache. In that case, in a microwave safe bowl, heat the chocolate for 20 to 30 seconds, removing it every 10 seconds and give it a mix. Continue to mix until the chocolate is fully melted and the mixture is even. So the ganache is ready. Set aside and allow it to cool completely. Now we are shifting to the next step. Take 250 g cold whipped cream. Whip the cream until you get soft peaks. Whip on medium speed. The cream is already sweet, so I am not adding any extra sugar to it. Add 2 tablespoon ganache to the cream. Start whipping at medium low until the chocolate is mixed evenly. Scrape the sides with the spatula. Add more 3 tablespoon of chocolate ganache. Whip again on low speed for about a minute. Now add the remaining chocolate ganache. Start whipping until it mixes well and refrigerate it before piping for 15 to 20 minutes. Keeping it in the freeze just after making the mousse will help to give you a shape when you will pipe the mousse with the nozzle using a piping bag. Put the mousse in the piping bag. You can use any nozzle of your choice. I have used 1M piping star nozzle. Pipe the chocolate mousse in a small serving glass or jar. If you do not have a piping bag, you can divide the mousse into the serving bowl or glass with a spoon. 
This is in a perfectly smooth and light consistency. Grate some chocolate. Top the chocolate mousse with the grated chocolate. You can decorate the mousse however you like. I think this is perfect for all chocolate lovers. You can make it a day before and keep it in the freeze. Eggless chocolate mousse is best served cold. The mousse is very soft, smooth and utterly delightful. Hope you like my quick and simple recipe for a creamy eggless chocolate mousse.